Hello, hello, hello. Good morning, special spirits. A light is wonderful to see you today. I know I haven't did a car ramble with you in a while. Yeah, I know someone's saying, where is spirit? Spirit, where you at? I'm present. I'm here. Yes, I'm going to go get my brakes worked on. You know, when you still drive it and you hear the car brakes still going after you stop, it's still going. That's that's how bad the brakes is. I'm like I'm worried now. I don't know if I'm like if the rotors are connected to the brakes, but you know, I really just want my front brakes fixed. But you know, if I messed up something, it's gonna cost more, and that's what I'm doing today. I feel so good this morning. I'm not talking about like physically, because physically I'm not like the best, but I feel so wonderfully mentally like I just feel like smiling I feel like the sun is shining I feel like the my spirit is vibrant and excited about life <laughs> at this moment yes I, I just oh you hear it? oh my god <sighs> embarrassing like <laughs> I'm glad I don't have far to go to get to where I'm going. I'm going to break check this morning and I just happened coincidentally couldn't found break check because um I drove up and down. It seems like whenever you're looking for something specifically, you can't find it. But when you're not looking for it, it's all over the place like you see it everywhere i couldn't find a place to get my brakes fixed nowhere and um i found me a brake check that's you know uh, it's, it's it's quite a few miles up from where i live at but i'm just so freaking happy that i found them <sighs> And they specifically work on brakes, so I don't have to worry about them asking, can they do anything else to the car or trying to find something else wrong with this freaking car? Oh, my God. Anyway, you guys, yes. I've been dealing with some bad energy. I feel like I picked up some bad energy somewhere. You know, sometimes people go through a lot and uh, sometimes people have things that they're responsible for like if they committed bad karma they have to pay for that and it's going to come rather they like it or not even if they start to do good things they still got to pay for the bad that they had caused and the hurt that they have caused so I feel like I picked up some negative dust and I have to find a way now to shake it off and get it. Well, actually, I did. I prayed it off of me. I prayed that, <laughs> I prayed that negative dust off of me. Yes. Oh, my God. I kept saying, oh, my God. Every time I turn around, it's one thing after another. Unusual things are happening. Like, what is going on? I had to check myself. Like, okay, spirit. What's going on with your energy? Think about what you're doing, what you've done, or who you've been around. Because, okay, some stuff is going on, okay? <laughs> and I said, okay, oh my God. God, I'm sorry. Earth, I'm sorry. Universe, I'm sorry. Galaxy, I'm sorry. Whew, put me back in your good graces. About a good hour to see and maybe longer for my breaks to get done. But I'm sitting here watching this story that happened right here in Harris County. A woman, she's a 911 operator, hung up on hundreds of people calling for 911. And the man that worked here just told me that it was a robbery recently where a man called 911 and she hung up on him and then they found him dead. They only spent up to a year in jail. Like, oh my God, can you imagine calling 911 and the operator hang up on you? I the freak. Oh my God, it's 13 minutes in a while, but it is, the news is crazy this morning. We'll talk to you in a little bit. My poor car. I hope it don't take forever to get it done. They get all of the breaks right now. I mentioned that I went to Whole Foods and 
one of the reasons why we went there is because my daughter got this idea that she should pick up some dates for me. Okay, we're gonna go pick up dry dates. Are we on film? No, you're not on film. <laughs> it's facing me. See? It's facing me. Video? Yeah, I have a YouTube channel. Yeah. Good, so? Everything. I uh, vlogged my life. I found you. Coincidentally, I had to ask around, um, where do you get your breaks? Because you know how you go to a place and they do everything and you specifically want like certain things done? So I was looking for a break place and I was all the way down town Houston <laughs> and I ended up at this tire place and all of the tire people said they never even heard of a, just a break place, the, the, the company. And a person who was getting their tires done said, I go to um, a break check. At first he told me to go down Westheimer and Fountain View. I couldn't find it. So I just kept on driving down Westheimer and I found it. And I came here yesterday, but it was too late, but you made me an appointment. Yeah, yeah. I was trying to push him out. Yeah. Take a look at your baby. Yes. I'll be back you guys. Just got through looking at my car and seeing the damage. I'm gonna be paying 161 and 28 cents. What he's past, and actually, they told me I need back brakes. I'm getting the front brakes, and I'm getting the rotor smoothed out because it's the rotors or something. He says the reason why my brakes probably went so fast, but you actually change your brakes every two to three years, depending on what type of driver you are. An average job driver, an average driver, two to three years, and ah, uh, my goodness. First, he told me altogether it would be $515 because with the back brace, I also need a flush, an ear flush for the brakes that it takes all of the old liquids out of your lines and air and they flush them out. I said, well, you're going to have to make me an appointment. He said, when? I said, when I got some money. So I'll call you back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll be back for that. But right now, I'm just going to get the front brakes done because that's more important. Oh, my God. Um, mm, you guys, look at my skin. Oh, my God. I, I cleaned it really good. I washed it in coconut oil. And my little friend that attached itself to my life, which is right here, I can feel you. It's like scabbing up, but it's finally trying to go away. Oh my god, you guys, that freaking delicious green tea that I got from pepperonis the other day. You guys seen it in that vlog. Um, hmm. I could be wrong, but it might be vlog 73. Maybe, I don't know. It might be vlog 74. <laughs> I don't know. But I know, I think today this is vlog 75. Yeah. That freaking thing attached itself to my face, and I cannot get rid of that bump. And that's what I get for always being tempted, you know? I need to focus on drinking things that's not going to cause me to break out. Unless I'm going to stay in the house and hide away from the world, then I can drink whatever I want. <laughs> A special spirit like asked me where did I get my top from the other day from the gum popping video. Well, it's not a top. It was a dress. A hot, sweet, cute dress. It's so cute. Yeah, I love it too. And it's mauve color. Yeah. And it was only $33. And I actually think it was on sale. So if I'm not mistaken it was somewhere like around $23 for the dress but it was cute yes I thought that would be perfect for the video so yes I did I wore that dress now I ain't wear it outside yet <laughs> but I would for the video I got it from Go Jane. I got nine items that I'm sending back I'm gonna tell you what I'm saying I bought some <laughs> 
I put some chokers, you guys. I swear, I, I trying to, you know, change my style a little bit because my daughter, Latoya, told me that she loved my videos. But every time she watched my videos, I got the same freaking scarf on. I got the same freaking blouse on. And she said, I, she always said, I bet not see that, that blouse no more. Don't wear it no more. You're supposed to fake the fuck and put on a different blouse just for the moment. <laughs> <laughs> I told Toya, I said, I don't have time for all of that. It's just I move by the spirit. Whatever's going on with me, well, honey, that's what you're going to see. If I wear the same flowers over and over again, it's the truth. I ain't doing it just to be funny. <laughs> <laughs> it's the truth. I do. I tend to just, well, if I got something, I forget that I had it on the other day. It's clean, so I put it on, okay? I ain't got nobody to impress. Who am I impressing? My, most of my spirits are like, so like it's me for who I am. Rather, I'm in the natural or all dressed up with makeup on or no makeup on with hair. Or no hair. <laughs> Y'all know how I like to do. I like to hide my hair sometimes. Look at this scarf. I got it nice and flat. There's no way for no one to know that I actually got here. And you know, that actually was, I actually had a moment that was so funny one time. Um, a guy asked me out on a date. <laughs> And when he asked me out, I had a scarf that made my hair nice and flat like this. I had no makeup. I was in the natural and everything. And Lord and behold, I shows up on that date looking like <laughs> I was about to step out on Hollywood so bad go away. He said, what the? He said, wow, dang, you are already pretty, but oh my God, you fun. <laughs> I was like, I couldn't even stop smiling. He goes, I'm so sorry to be staring at you. You're so pretty. And I was like, oh, thank you, you know. So, yeah, I'm like, I'm like you know, hey, ain't nothing wrong with just being yourself sometimes. Then it ain't nothing wrong with looking good, girl. Slay. You can slay, slay, yay. <laughs> Yes, because Lord knows if I had the energy and the, I do have the time. It's the energy to put into it or the motivation, you know, like, I don't have that motivation to just jump in the mirror and be like, let me do my makeup today. I do my makeup because I feel like sometimes it's necessary, depending on what I need to be doing, you know. I experiment, so I will, you know, sit down and play in the makeup a little bit. But I'm not one of those people that play in the makeup all the time. Although I like to buy makeup and, and get new eyeshadows and pretty blushes. Yes, because Lord knows I love to be blushy. I would love to have a whole lot of pink blush on right now. <laughs> but that would look crazy because I ain't got no makeup on. Yeah, this is spirit skin, all the little spots and light spots and dark spots and little bumps and flaws. Perfectly flawed. I got off the subject of gold Jane. You see how much I be running my mouth? Um, I got to send nine items back because I was about to tell y'all what happened, but then I got on the subject about the guy. I'm so crazy. I, I know y'all catches that in the videos. I be telling y'all something and did I completely forget to show you something? <laughs> Can I say I'm sorry now? I'm so sorry. I bought some chokers from Go Chain. You guys, I felt like somebody put their hand around my throat. Like, <laughs> I told my daughter, I said, I'm trying to get used to the chokers because I want to, like, you know, change up my style a little bit, but you, those chokers make me feel like you're going <laughs> to look in the corner and I'm going to be dead. <laughs> Because I, I can't breathe. Freaking chokers was choking the hell out of me. I told my daughter, I'm sending those things back. I don't even want them. I want my money back. Because one choker, I paid like $10. And one choker was like $8. Some taxes. and mm -mm. I'm, But I'm going to find some chokers that I like. i, I got to find one. I know I'm going to find one. My neck is all short. I wish my neck was like tall. Because I feel like I'll be... I'm, I feel like my neck not long enough for chokers, you know? Uh, you know, but even though I love my my neck I still oh a choker straight hair and a hat mm, yes I saw that style on go Jane and that's the style that I wanted to go for 
It ain't gonna work out for me. Everything don't work out for everybody. Everybody can't wear everything somebody else wear, you know. And going back to Toya, Toya, shut up. Toya like to dress. How about sit down and have tea? Tea and biscuit, please. Thank you so much. <laughs> That's Toya. No. <laughs> Telling me that she tired of seeing me with the same clothes on. Then bring your butt back home to Texas and take me shopping. Okay. Yeah, I'm waiting on my uh, gift box from Toya. Oh my God. You guys, let me tell you. I got an email from Much Pack. And is it Mum Pack or Much Pack? I don't know, but I gotta look it up again. But because I'm not at my computer, so I don't know. Just talking off the top of my head. But yeah, my Munch Pack, I got the tracking numbers on its way. And what it is is that you get food from all over the world and they wanted me to just basically try it out. I guess talk about it on my YouTube, which I'm excited to do because I love trying new things. I'm so excited. And you guys, you know I got my post office box now and I gave y'all the address, so make sure you write it down. Let me see if I got the card to my post office box right now. So you can't say, Stanley, you never got a post office box. You never gave me your post office box to send you some of the candy, because I know I, I got spirits of lights from Ireland, um, let's see, UK, um, Colombia, uh, Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh my god, oh my god, don't forgive me if I didn't name your place. Um, Denmark, um, oh my god, um, oh, Scotland, yes, yeah, Scotland. Uh, there's another Brazil. Ooh. And, uh, oh, and oh my god, they from all over. You guys know where y'all from. Yeah, leave me a comment, let me know where you're from because sometimes they'll say, Hey, um, from Alabama, just saying, Hey, you know, something like that. But it's like the wild bag they left on the video, so it'd be nice to see comments to say, Hey, spirit, I'm from here, I'm from there, whatever. Just say, Hey, and let me know where you're from. I remember I had got a special feel like it asked me to do a reaction to some of my old videos. <laughs> I am not ready to do that because I think I clicked on one video and it was like, hello from the other side. <laughs> Del song, y'all remember that? Hello, it's me or something. Y'all know I ain't got no tune. What time she sing it? Hello from the other side. I ain't got no tune. But anyway, Adele song, hello. I was like, oh my freaking God, I wish I could go and freaking cut <laughs> and cut it out. <laughs> but you know what, at the time that I did those videos, I really was like, oh, I got this. I'm doing a good job with editing. Oh my God, I love the video. Like when I did it at the time, I loved the hell out of it, okay? So yeah. Yeah, I know. Going back, I probably got roasted. <laughs> I fell out. I was like, oh my God, no. We're supposed to be going to the chiropractor today. A couple of things to do. I was looking for this freaking lip gloss everywhere. The she lip gloss don't nothing make my lips look pretty like this. Oh my God, when I don't want to put on lipstick or anything, like this right here is the bomb. I'm <laughs> sorry, you guys. I got to make it work. I got the camera in one hand, so, you know. Oh, Ooh, that feel good. I can't find it, but you know what? It will be at the bottom of the video. Um, and feel free uh, to contact me, send me a letter, send me some candy, or, you know, whatever. You got my post office box, feel free. My rose quirt back on, isn't she pretty? Oh my God, I love this thing, it's so pretty. Oh, conditional love. 
type energy towards you, you know. So I love this rose quartz. We turned nine items back to go, Jane. I got some cute stuff, but I didn't like the material. I could have went to it for 20 months skirt, and I had ordered like an extra large, and it's like extra, 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 extra large. Like something's wrong. Like I was like, <laughs> so I'm five three. You know, you know, a skirt's supposed to just stop like at your ankles or whatever. This skirt kept going way past my feet, okay? My daughter fell out. She was on the floor. She <laughs> <It> was rolling. <laughs> and then I had bought a jumper. It was so cute on the website. It was so freaky cute. And it was an ivory, but it was uh, short and stopped, cut off at the knee, and it had no sleeves and I was going to use it to, you know, do my Zumba in. Oh, I had so much fun doing Zumba with my daughter. But when I put that freaking jumpsuit, my daughter said, um, oh, it looks nice, Mom. It looks nice, you know. Just wait until you lose, like, about 10 pounds. It's really going to look nice. I looked in a freaking full-size mirror. I felt like I looked like an overgrown baby. Did a bib or something. I, I took that damn suit off. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't, it didn't, you know how most onesies kind of hold you in and tighten and everything up and make everything look tight. Everything, everything just, just fell out, just loose. I, I had to take it. I'm sending that back. I sent it. I sent my, my items back and, and out of everything I kept was uh, the shoes, the mop dress, and I have a onesie burgundy um, piece that I had them, you only can see the top because I did it in the, what video I did? The candy apple um, video, birthday video that I did for one of the special spirit lights. That was a one piece. Yeah, I kept that one, that was cute. But uh, I got a lot of eggs, so it was like I don't make it. It's a more sweater over it, trying to tone it down. <laughs> Confident to be walking around here like Beyonce in a one piece. I don't, I don't, I don't, I just ain't got it yet. I just ain't got that much confidence. But if you got the confidence, do it. Yes. Yes, do it. Because when I see people in one piece, I'm like, oh, stop. I put one piece on, I'm like, oh, I'm scared to go out the door. But anyway, I'm so ready to get my car so I can get out here and get finished with my day. <sighs> Here go my box that I'm getting ready to return all of the Godane things. Check this out. Is this not the cutest thing? These shoes right here. Look, I shouldn't be taking them out the box because I tried to pack it up, but a lot of the stuff already done fell out. Gotta repack it. But got these shoes from Gojane. They're really cute. They're ballerina shoes. But I'm returning them because when you walk, they have like the creases in right here. It creases out like this when you walk. So I got to return them. But they are so freaking cute and it was only like $12. ballerina skirt had got it to go over like the onesie it's that pretty silk material it's really pretty but I'm returning it because I'm also returning the onesie so I don't even want it like this leather choker I thought would be really cute and you just kind of tie it around your neck like a bow tie but I don't know it looked more like a belt to me, so I didn't like that one. And hopefully everything goes smooth. Jane package that most of the stuff came in. Let's see, it says for Jane right there. For the ones who want to know, like where I got that top and the shoes, I want to go Jane www.jane.com too too long but it's just overly overly cute 
and I loved the material, but it was just too, too long. I would have saved that box from when Toya was here and she shipped a lot of stuff back home, like two of her boxes. I was supposed to actually buy crabs and put crabs <laughs> and send it to her. So, but anyway, I'm gonna use the box today. I hope my shipping is cheap. All right, see you in a little bit. Okay, that didn't take long at all. Got free shipping from Gojane and I had to pay $22.50 to send that stuff back. <sighs> But at least it went fast. It was like five minutes. But I picked up some things while I was in there. This one is called Call Good Luck Call Fortune. Lem Ola Bana Sota. I don't know. La Forta de La Manos. I don't know. I think it's Spanish. But there we go. Mm. And this one smells like a, a, like a soap and maybe a flower. It's kind of eerie and light and refreshing. Mmm, smells pretty good. And then this one is money drawn. And it says, Altrea Dinero? Altrea, 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 Altrea Dinero? I don't know. It's, just, it's Spanish though. Mmm. And it's, this one smell like, you know, like a pamper box. You know when we take the, the pampers out the box for a, a brand new baby and it's got that scent and like maybe powder. Mmm. And really light and airy. It smells really, really good. Mmm. Mmm. Call of good luck. Call fortune. Yes. That's what I'm talking about. See the horseshoe on the package? <laughs> so cute. I'm on my way to the chiropractor. And then... I think I'll go home and FaceTime my daughter, my oldest daughter, and see what she up to. Actually, I feel better after I left the joint. See, my neck nice and loose. Oof. But it feels sore. You know, when they pop it, it kind of hurt for a minute. But I am about to go get me some yogurt from Yogurt Land. So I will continue having, like, the best day ever. <laughs> Yes, as a matter of fact, I think I'll give these shades a rest so I can make sure uh, I can see the yogurt that I'm picking. <laughs> you know spirit can barely see now. I'm loving my skin today. It's so pretty. Oh my God. Even though I got like the little tiny leftover pimples from that terrible drink. And soon it'd be gone away. You know, sometimes you gotta give your face a break. Yeah.
I literally just woke up like 10 minutes ago and I'm still feeling like I'm sleeping. Uh-uh. Went home. I like that freaking yogurt. From yogurt land was so good. It was delicious. I'm so tired. I need to lay down and take me a nap. My son had came into the house. Felt something like touch my shoulder and then lay against my chest. And my son was checking to see if I was still alive. My son said, what are you doing? He's like, hey, mom. You're late to go pick up Nadine. You okay? I said, yeah, I just lay down thinking, man. He said, you sleep so quiet. I said, boy, why couldn't you just tap me and say, hey, mom? Mom, why every time I go to your videos, you eat him? Mm. Make a lollipop good, but the stomach, the stomach stick is so short. <laughs> I said, well, the toy don't watch the eating videos. Oh, but I like them. They put me to sleep. It's so relaxing. And she said, I saw you eat this. I saw you eat that. I said, well, Latoya, you watching my life in a few minutes to one half an hour. It's 24 hours in a day. And I have to eat. I'm watching my day all wrapped up in maybe a few minutes, maybe a half an hour or an hour. Like, I literally just record the majority of time when I do eat. And that's what I do. Like, seriously, Toya? Oh, my God. How do you want to love my videos and they call me and tell me, why are you doing this? And why are you doing it? And mom, can I ask you about this? And can I ask you? <laughs> I'm freaking thirsty. I left my water bottle rushing, trying to come get anything. So I'm so freaking tired, like sleepy. You know when you lay down for a quick nap, yeah, and you go into a deep sleep, and you don't even sleep maybe like 40 minutes? Oh my God. <laughs> I think my whole body still sleep. Mm, it's like pop it's so good like what the freak name is this I know it's a bowl pop I'm not tired. I can't even see it now. Mm. Mm. It's lemon, lime, hmm. yeah, it says lemon, lime, but I don't, 
tastes like let me taste like a fruit punch to me. Mm. Mmm, really good. Now if I had some water to top it off. I think they're about to have church outside. The music is relaxing, right? I don't know if you can hear it through the car. Mm -hmm. No. I think that's just some bag a Mexican guy. He over there. I think he's just playing the music real loud. He's enjoying it. Wow, this is nice. Into the night. Nice relaxation vlog. A little bit of mouth sounds. Mm. You could just listen to what's going on in the vlog and close your eyes and almost go to sleep. Probably will go to sleep. I met a man today while I was getting my brakes done. 67 years old. He married. He got one daughter. He'd been over here in America since 1980 from Israel. It was very interesting. His grandbaby is so pretty. She's only a month old. Oh my goodness. She's absolutely gorgeous. He sat there. And I think he showed me all the pictures of the baby. He told me he sent them over to his family in Israel. And everybody's just so happy for them. And I was like, oh my God, that's you, your wife. So happy. He said, happy? Man, she ecstatic. so funny <laughs> he said my wife is in love with that grandbaby he said we our daughter is spoiled she's 30 years old and she a lawyer but when she had that baby for us i was saying to myself oh my god she had a baby they said she had the baby for them <laughs> he said the daughter moved six minutes from them the mom cooked for her every single day Go to the house and clean for her and take care of the baby. She do the majority of the work because it's so much. They said they never knew it was so much taking care of the baby. I bet it's, they, they put more into it than they have to because they're so in love with the baby. And at that moment, I just felt happy for him. He was so happy. <laughs> so, I hope you guys are having a wonderful night and a great
great evening and I hope that you ate well and that you did something good for yourself today even if it was something really really small don't let life pass you by life is wonderful it's wonderful to be able to enjoy small things the small moments because our life is actually really short. It's flying by like this, like that. It's gone. Now, when I think about the people that I loved and now they no longer here, I hope that they got to enjoy small moments of their life. And that's what I hope for you. I hope you find a reason to be happy. You know, like every day, negative things happen. There's nothing we can do about it. Sometimes we even cross, you know, through negativity or we pick up particles and dust of negativity. And it's just there, you know. And sometimes bad things happen. It's either a lesson or a blessing. And then... You have to ask the question, which one is it? And then whichever one it is, you go into it and say, okay, why was this a lesson? Or why was this a blessing? And then you move forward from there. But you can't wallow in the negativity because negativity brings more negativity. The more you focus on the bad things that happen, more stuff that happens. And more you focus on what you don't have, the less things you have. So focus on something great and some of the great things you have so more great things can come. All right, you guys, this is it for me. See you in the next video. I'm at the Chinese restaurant with my team and I'm about to order me some. I think it says garlic and scallop. Scallop and garlic sauce. Oh, so really? It looked really, really good. And I got me some green tea. It looks pretty good. So I'm just ready to order. You ready to order? There's no way to get down. No. Gay noodles taste pretty good too. It looks good. They say it would be sweet and sour cold, crispy cold things. Oh, the tea is overly hot. Can I take a sip of that? But Nadine's cold tea look good. But I think it got sugar in it. Is it unsweetened or sweetened? I'm trying to ask her. I think it's sweetened. We should taste it. I'm going to ask her to get her to Yeah. I don't want no eggplant tonight, though. I just want something different. Something that tastes good, you guys. Oh, my God. Whew. When I sat down in this seat, this seat looked like it could be at home in my living room. This is what it looked like. Oh. Man, I'm so comfortable. I wish I could put my feet up, lay back, and go to sleep and watch TV. Garlic and scallop. Garlic and scallop. Garlic and scallop. Garlic and scallop. And scallop. Okay, that comes with shrimp beans or broccoli. What it comes with? Rice? Rice. Steamed rice. Do it come with vegetables? Huh? Any vegetables? Uh, a little bit broccoli. Okay, good. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that sounds good. I'm ready to eat too. Do you have crab hmm? No, we don't have. Mm -hmm. What do you want? You want the vinegar or the spice? Mm -hmm. You want the spice? This restaurant is so pretty. Oh my gosh. This is such a cute place to come eat. And I'm telling you, I found this place to go, you guys, out here. Um, get me some yogurt from yogurt and I told my daughter about it and I said I found this Chinese restaurant we really love like actual Chinese restaurants and I said do you want to go eat she said yeah let's go sit down and eat I said yeah why not 
<laughs> this is such a beautiful restaurant, you know. Normally for like a place like this, I probably put on makeup and a wig and get all dressed up. But I actually feel good just being all cozy today. Look at these little pillows. Being a little cozy and, and comfortable. Man, I feel like I'm up in my living room. This is my house. Mm -hmm. All this pretty stuff. Shoot. <laughs> Yeah, you guys, it is so beautiful. Love the scenery. It is so pretty in here. Oh my goodness. And I love the armoire. Check it out. The armoire is so inspiring. It makes me want to decorate maybe me an area that's so pretty. And kind of go with the oriental thing. I love the oriental look. It's just uh, so pretty. Yes, you guys. I'm, my food needs to hurry up and come. The tea done cooled off real quick. Mm, and it's some real green tea. Oh, you did? Good. Thank you, Nadia. Mmm. 